been filming a lot of videos outside recently, and that's mostly because they've been beautiful days, but also because the light that sits above my desk in the garage has fallen down, which means I have no light for any of my videos. I hope to get that fixed soon, but if I can't, I'll just buy some studio lights and fix it that way. So we'll see what happens. Hopefully I get that fixed really, really quick, but otherwise I can just film out here like what I did with the judge opening up video. So regardless, I've got a couple of announcements to make. The first of which is that I'm going to be at All's Fair in Olympia, Washington at the Thurston County Fairgrounds June 30th to July 2nd or this weekend. Sorry about the kind of short delay. I filmed a video about this yesterday, but I got every single facet of information wrong because there's so much. It's a giant LARPing event with tons of people and tons of different categories of things, whether you're into like HEMA stuff or LARP or even Nerf, like HVZ and stuff like that. Yes, Olympia Foam Society will be putting on HVZ games and a variety of other Nerf games that people are invited to come join and have fun with. And then I'll also be there with my own panel set to kind of just do live modding. I'll have a table set up and I'll be modding stuff so you can come talk to me and watch me build blasters for the various events that are gonna be happening during that weekend. My first kind of modding session is going to be Friday and that's going to be from 11.30 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. And then there's one on Saturday and Sunday as well. I'll have all the information down in the description box below that you can check out. And of course, there's a lot more than just Nerf there. They have feasts and castles and siege weapons and all this crazy stuff. And it's all meant to be family fun orientated. So I'm looking forward to it. That's going to be very, very soon. And again, I'm sorry for the short delay. <sighs> Been working on stuff. Speaking of which, well, I like building stuff and this dislike bot thing's been kind of annoying. So I opened up commissions, which a lot of people have emailed me about. A lot of people have emailed me about, and some of them even emailed me right. If you're interested in doing commissions, I do have the video up and read the description. It very easily understands or describes exactly what's going on with those. But for those of you who don't want to do commissions and for those of you who still want to support the channel and want to get rewarded for doing so, I set up a Patreon. This is something I kind of avoided doing and the commissions were kind of a bandage for that, but I still had a lot of people telling me that they would like to support the channel, but they don't want to worry about commissions or anything like that. So I just opened that up. I sat there and thought about it for a long time. This was way before I decided to take commissions and I finally wrote up a rough draft a couple of weeks ago and decided to launch it today. So let me know what you think about that. The basic goal is that, again, I still just want to create things. That's all I want to do. So the first goal is $200. If I can reach $200 a month, I will produce not only a blaster in the similar caliber to things like the Chimera Strike, the Hellsender, the Deleter, the Paradigm Shift, and the Divine Punishment, and so forth, but I'll also produce a complete build video for every single one I make from then on. This is something I've kind of avoided doing because it's a pain in the butt to not only edit that much footage and make it cohesive, but also set up the camera every single time I want to make a cut or do a small change. So this is my kind of uh, middle ground. I will do it as long as, you know, it's lucrative to do so. Um, kind of dumb way of doing it, but those videos take a long time to make and generally my mind works in such a roundabout way that I don't think about things exactly before I do it. It's mostly just happy accidents as Bob Ross would have put it. So if you're interested in that, again, all of my videos are going to be free for everybody except for the little stupid extra stuff I'll put on Patreon, but there are a variety of tiers. They start at, you know, things like you get a unique rank in the Fuzzy Walrus Discord channel, you'll get access to sneak peeks of blasters I'm working on and stuff like that, pictures, you'll be able to make suggestions, you'll be able to vote for blasters that are going on with tag back which a lot of people are going to be interested in, which means I might actually have to do the video on the Maverick Recon, Crossbow, Vulcan. Yeah, those are all special videos, but hey, if people are donating to Patreon and that's the stuff they want to see, that's pretty much what I have to do. So that is a thing. And again, it even goes up to like, I will send you a signed dart in a collector's pet G tube in the mail directly to you. Is it worth it? No, but it's fun and stupid. And that's kind of what the whole thing is about. So if you're interested, I will have a link to that and it will be at the link of like at the end title screen of all my videos from here on out, which should make it pretty easy to, you know, for people to check that thing out. I've already had four patrons and I haven't even really announced it. I briefly posted it to my Facebook and just a little text post and I posted it in the discord and already I've had Beret, I've had Darren, I've had Mr. Sonic OG and even Soviet Kitty. All all of them have already become patron fuzzlers so i thank those four and i hope many more of you will join us and together we can build some pretty crazy stuff 
I mean, even if it gets to a certain amount, I can, you know, still produce videos. Like, I'm, I'm gonna produce videos no matter what. All my videos are always gonna be free, but even it's like, oh, I'm only reaching this amount this month. Well, if the next month it reaches that amount, like, you know, cumul culmate, I can't even pronounce the word, together, then we will still build stuff and produce videos for that. But the entire point is that, you know, if you donate to Patreon, it reaches goals and I can produce stuff faster because then I don't have to worry about doing anything else. In fact, I can shrug off doing other stupid stuff like playing video games to, you know, try to mask the crippling uh, feels of doing, dealing with dislike botters and stuff like that. And I can just sit out in the garage and work for hours on end like I used to do last summer when everything was better. <sighs> well... I think that's pretty much everything I wanted to talk about. I do have a lot of videos in the pipeline right now, a lot of builds and stuff like that. If you want to see that kind of stuff, again, you can check out the Patreon. It is, you know, most of that is going to be masked behind Patreon tiers, but if you want to be involved with that kind of stuff, it's there for you. Stuff like this. I'm Walcom S7. Thank you very much for watching this video, and of course, I hope to see you in an entirely different one, and I do hope to see you at All's Fair this weekend.